Hello, everyone, and welcome back to the world of Risk Global Domination. I'm Kilted. I'm a competitive player in Risk Online. Today, we're at the Yellow Anonymous fella from the United States of America. We're Merkin today, y'all, and we're going to be playing classic fixed risk. Old school risk, but we're going to play it with blizzards on, so I want to see the blizzards choke up the map. Ideally, Congo blizzard, India blizzard, Greenland blizzard. So Greenland blizzard's neat because North America is going to be a two-point guard. North America plus South America together is a two-point guard. How come I have zero troops on the left side of the board? What the hell is this spawn for Australia, bro? He should have put it all on the six. Okay, it doesn't matter. He's getting it anyways. What the hell is this start? Green's just dominating. Before anything happens, Green just takes everything. Grab his dick and twist it! Are you chain fire, the old twisty? I mean, I do have... Like, I can bring all my troops up to Europe and try to be the Europe guy. I could be the Africa guy or the Europe guy. I'm going second last, so... I think I'm going to come into Ukraine. I think I'm going to go Middle East to Ukraine attack and bring North Africa up. And then I'm going to try to get Pink to go down. I want Pink to go for something else. <clears throat> Thank you for the 100 bits, Chainfire. Brosif. Kyle's driving the bus and we're all in the back seats, baby. All those frozen orange gorillas? Yeah. Okay, so we got Patrice from France. We've got Olin Eto from Canada. We've got Victor Rayano Shoji from Greece, I think. We've got MSF from, I don't know, Libya or something like that. I don't actually know. Yeah, I don't know what that one is. Uh, uh, th what's this? this one I was going to say is Libya. What? Shit, I don't know. I don't know. Middle Eastern flags, I don't know them very well. Take Australia? Yeah, I think Australia is mine. I'll just go right off my two. If I go off the two through the nine, I'm good. I think that's the best way to do it, right? Why don't you go for NA and SA as a two-point hold? Hey, hey, yeah. You'd think I'd want Africa, but I'm going to go for Europe. Going for Europe. I would like to get Pink to go for Africa. I also get out of this way in case somebody wants to go contest this. He goes left and brings us two in. Yeah, interesting. He doesn't even bring the two in. Well, we're forcing the red six down, which is good. He comes out. He's going to have a... He's just going to sit in China with a giant stack. Green's going to have a really easy game. What a spawn for him. Europe is cleaner because hard for both blue and black to get out of Africa. Yeah. Europe is cleaner if I can get pink to go this way. Like, and if I do get Africa, by the time I get it, pink has Europe, black has South America, and everybody's butting heads with me. And green's up here in China. I'm not feeling good about Africa this game. Just whatever the layout is, I don't like Africa. Especially with the Greenland Blizzard. Uh, people aren't able to get out of the left side except through Africa. And Kamchatka, obviously. This feels like Africa's weaker right now. Europe is stronger. North America is stronger. And uh, I'd actually say Australia is stronger than normal too because of this blizzard. Because you can be further up. This is going to be weird. Red and blue contesting this is going to be weird. Red should have went in here, man. Get out of my bonus. Did I leave this four here? Nice. I can actually come up here now and fortify that in. Ukraine, baby! Okay, we've got an artillery and a dude. So we just need a, a cavalry, and we're good to go. <clears throat> no way Kilted wins a game with a Congo Blizzard. What do you mean? 
I already own 60% of Africa. Oh, not anymore. Yeah, so pink might end up going for Africa now that it's getting more vacant, right? We just need red out of the way. Or I get my four out of the way. I might go uh, down with the four and then into the 15 and then his 10 might come through. And then we can have a relationship there. We're doing okay in troops, 24 and 23. Whatever the layout, I just don't like Africa. Kilted 2023 immediately before getting cancelled. Oh my god. What's the point of Africa if it doesn't have the Congo? Exactly! Something about Africa is less appealing all of a sudden. Black's about to die? It's, it's very surprising to me he actually got to hold that. I mean, I guess... I, yeah, I don't know. Pink's not even letting back through. Clearly, they bring the four to South America. Pink sucks. I don't think pink sucks. Well, I don't know. He goes here. He's blocking black four. I guess you're right. He is blocking this four. I wonder. Guy Green can also come up with his 11 and then bring Afghanistan into China. And then he could sit here with a big boy stack. And then he's in a great position if people start dying and stuff. Especially if he comes off and then somebody takes a card in Afghanistan, which Pink probably would. Pink would probably love to come through Afghanistan. So if he came up, brought the four out, he'd have a bigger stack here. And probably still be open to the rest of the board. Red coming down is good. Now I'm going to go up and in. Or don't cut off my lines to pink, maybe. Just in case. Like, this is all a pink in the middle. Blue's gonna roll a three on one. Nice. I like it. Okay, my lines are open to him anyways. I'm going to do this. And this. Double dudes. But I got a 21 stack. A 21 stack is hard to kill. It's also rather scary if you're uh, sitting in my bonus. Goes down. Does he bring the 10 in? He doesn't. He does let black out. Like, if I was him, I might even have, like, pop, pop and come in. I don't know. I would have played pink seed a lot differently. Yellow can totally ruin black's day. I can ruin anybody's day. I got a 21 stack. I can do whatever I want. I can go ba boom ba boom ba. I can go through here. I can go through here. I could ruin green's day. What's up, Papa Smurf? Good to find the catchy libro. Thanks, man. I'm happy to have you here. We're doing some classic fixed right now. I didn't show the settings, but it's classic fixed. World domination. Hard AI. 60 second turn timers. Alliances and blizzards are on, but no fog and no portals. Black trades on three. Infantry, wild artillery with a plus two in Siberia. Wow. Must be nice. Must be nice. If all players' skills were exactly equal with troops being equal, which area wins most? Like in Classic? Uh, most people generally think North America is probably the strongest on the board. It depends, right? Because if everybody's equal skill, it depends. If everybody's a lower skill, then whoever lets the other people fight has a better chance of winning. It doesn't come down to which position. It comes down to... I guess, the psychology of the game. That's what makes Classic Fix so... Oh, what the fuck? It comes down to more of the psychology of the game in that in that perspective. The hell was that, man? He just 11 on 7. He's like, blue, get out of here. Like, that is not good. Red and blue are going to implode. If blue doesn't have a trade on 4 and red kills this 12... with it, If red trades on 4 and kills this 12... I can kill blue for five cards next turn. OK. 
I don't want to make that a two so it lives, right? But I also want to make my stack bigger and ready to kill. There's no line on red, really, right? So... Make it a two, just to hold that position. And I have lines on all of blue here. And I do have a big boy trade, right? I do. I have lines on all of blue out here. If red knocks blue out, we're laughing. I'm still too strong here to die to pink. The two over here. Looks like he's going to actually just take Africa. Probably pop the five and the four. Or is he going to try to threaten them out? Or is he just going to fortify that to his nine, maybe? Nope. He does an extra attack to hit the red. Okay. And he does hit the four. Now I'm going to ally black. He stacks right here. Ooh, that's very threatening to black. He doesn't have a trade either. Uh, how do I get to red? Four, one... One one three? That's a lot to go through. Or four one two three. Rather go through two ones than a two though. Oh I just wanted to hang out in Japan. I don't like you. I literally just don't like you. Why did I put a troop in Japan? Now I hit your four stack? Bro, if red trades and knocks this 12 out and blue doesn't trade, we're in some serious business. Now if red doesn't trade and blue fail kills him, that's also okay. I could also theoretically just take Europe. I could trade and take Europe and not kill anybody. It's another play. Yellow looks amazing. Thanks, Chainfire. I've been working out. I don't I don't know. I don't know what this is, but we're doing it. 41111. That nice. Now a bunch more ones to go through. Um uh, Red Trades. It's bongo. Alliance! Bro, you just slapped me in Japan. Sure. Oh, red's coming out. He's not going to hit blue's 12. He's going to give it to blue? Okay, I think I'm trading and just taking Europe. He's leaving on a jet plane. All right. Old Kyle would kill people and take Europe. Well, if the opening was that blue has literally five cards and I cannot kill him. I cannot kill him. But black can. I'm going to offer Pink an alliance and see if he likes it. Four on one's gross. Okay. That's my take. You got my little twos. I got Europe after all that. Thumbs up. I would love if he took the Middle East here and then had a stack on it. I'm also cool with him just chilling. He's got him wide open here for blue or green to break. I mean, I'm open too. Why did Kilt just bounce this man boobs at me? Working on them boobers. I don't know, man. It was for Chainfire. I guess Chainfire gets special treatment. Bro, waited for a trade to leave NA. Yeah. So Red smacked an 11 on 7 on blue. 
and then fortified awkward, and then traded and left at North America. I think he doesn't know what he's doing. I also like this build up here, because these guys might get scared of each other at some point. We'll see. Black doesn't kill blue. I guess eight. Yeah, he probably would have been tough. So blue gets to trade. Black's going to not back out of North America. He's not giving it to blue, though. Honestly, if I'm black, I probably force blue at... I, I would have positioned to try to kill blue, kind of like I was hoping to as yellow. If I was black, I would have positioned to kill blue, and I would have killed blue and taken North America, and then given pink South America. Black probably had that opening. Now red's going to have three cards and be stuck here. What cup size are you? I don't know, man. <laughs> I've never measured my cup size. What the hell? Um, do you kill red? Do you smash black? You smash black. Please don't break me. Make an alliance with him. He wants the bonus. He he smashes black and then takes North America. Doesn't even take North America. While his four is also guarding my bonus. <clears throat> okay. Cool. Right, we'll take this. We chill. I actually think I have a big trade again. Yeah. Alright. Allied with blue now. I bet you remember Chainfire being in your kick stream. Oh, no. Uh, Hippo, don't do that. I can't even. You're beating Chainfire on the leaderboard, right? This is the like the one day a month or whatever I put the leaderboard to show all time instead of monthly. Trying to represent or show the homies that are like true supporters, which I appreciate all of you. I remember Chainfire in the kickstream too. So yes. Sorry, Hippo. That kickstream was painful. Dude, only up is fun. I really like that game. Was that moved by Blue? I have no idea. I have no idea what Blue was doing. 12 set on 3. Nice for some. Oh, yeah. Oh, did Green get a 12 set on 3? Is he going to break my bonus? No, he's not. Okay. <clears throat> oh, you mean for me? Yeah. Well, I lose my Afghanistan, though. Yeah, to be honest, Hippo, everybody was trolling me during that game. And I think you're just nice. Showing Hippo some love. Thank you, Chainfire. I appreciate it, man. Remove Black from Asia for Chaos? I mean, that's not a terrible idea. I ally Red, see if Red will hit him. I'll ask Red to hit Black. He's going to hit this one. Does he hit this two? Green might also hit it. Bro, hit that two. Hits the blue two. Hit the... You don't get Australia. There's no world in which you get Australia here. He can't even take North... Oh, now he can... Oh, my God. Big trade on three for blue. Black, no. Watch your bunghole. You're the worst dad ever. What's up, John? Okay, he does take North America. So we take blue out of here? He doesn't even take it. Because he's scared of red, maybe. Oh, man. I want to take that two out, but I'm not going through all this. What do I do? Can I just do something magical right now? If I trade, I have 52 stack. What do I do with a 52 stack? Only black would be kind of worth it, and I don't have him. So, we don't trade. Take a card, and we wait. And we're back. Oof. Scandinavia plus two is cool. That's more troops for me. Does pink put it in black's butt? I don't know. What I want to see... Give green a thumbs up. And ask him to hit black. If pink does this, it's bad for him. Like, this is a bad move for pink. 
It's a great move for green. This is a great move for green. Please. Please, please, please. Hit that too. Yeah, baby. Suck it. Oh, that's a heart right there. Yes. That starts that starts the drama train. Oh, baby, and I didn't have nothing to do with it. Woo! Big boy slap into Congo. The Congo is under a blizzard advisory warning right now. Oh, no. Oh, no. Holy crap. Is he just going to try to kill Pink? Pink didn't even do it. Green did it. He just stopped. <laughs> what? I mean, in what world does Pink not trade on the 16 and kill you now? In the world where I kill Pink? Pink's saying, oops. Yeah, obviously you're going to suicide him. Like, that just... The... Black needs to learn the lesson of, uh, you done goofed, kiddo. That was all from Green hitting that too, man. Does Red go into Alaska now? And he's like, screw you, Blue, I'm coming back. No, he doesn't. He's waiting for Blue to take a card here. And then he can kill him. But that's not good for him either. This is weird. I am so strong right now. Green's also relatively strong, but I'm going to get my eight troops in my trade. Oh my god, he's just smacking black in the back. Because he doesn't want to open red. You just had to take my Afghanistan, did you? Uh, I could do whatever I want right now. 69 troops. I could kill Pink, which I don't need to. Pink's going to retaliate into black. Pink and black are going to die together. Blue and red are weak. So the real thing is... Green... Where do I take a card that doesn't trap my stack, though? Because I want to go up and down. I want to actually hit the blue three. I'm going to hit the blue three. Hippo underscore Crip cheered X1000. Hope you're on for a couple more games because I'll be back. My employees keep breaking shit cold sweat smile. Bro, thank you so much, Hippo. Uh, I will be on for a little bit. I'm not rushing off, but we'll see. It depends how I feel, right? First game of the day was kind of a bummer, but... Today's, we're having fun in this game. As long as I'm in good spirits, got good energy in my throat's not hurting, I will be on for a bit. I am sick right now, but I, just a spoonful of Buckley's usually helps a little bit, so. So pink does kill black, as we thought. And it triggered a, an artillery trade for him. I'll give him a thumbs up. Um, now pink's on four with... 28. Would he hit pink? If he hit this at pink, I would kill pink, right? But then I would own too much of the board. He's going to go into red. I wonder if red does something. <laughs> Leaving a 7 there means red's... Other than the 1 here, if red puts everything on his stack, his cheapest card is actually a pink 5. Green's doing these weird stacks. So red either adds three here, takes a card, or he goes off the 30 and hits the pink five. What's blue going to do? He's going to do that. So blue could take a card here without opening Alaska. His throat is sore. Dot, dot, dot. Chainfire is going to be leaving shortly. Jesus, man. I thought you were hanging out all day. Spoonful of special white honey helps. I'll ship you some special white honey. I mean, I put honey in my tea when I have a sore throat, but I don't. I don't want your special white honey, your honey, honey, whatever the fuck. Twelve to the five, five to the twelve leaves a two here. I'd leave a two here. What is this? Pink's on 25. I kill Pink. Is basically just free. 
real estate. Kill pink, kill pink and break blue. But then red comes in. I have so much. Okay, let's play a game of like spice, right? Sugar and spice. I'm sorry, bro, but like... You were vulnerable to the point of just, let's eliminate you. Like, you can go to the next game. Um, yeah. 71. I could kill... I could kill blue. Trade, kill red, trade, and then try to card block green. But that's not enough, right? I lose too much killing these guys. I wouldn't have enough of an advantage over a green. Well, like three point guard. Nah. I back right off. Give red a thumbs up. And give blue a thumbs up. And give green a thumbs up. They can take my Africa. I think if I was faster on thinking, I might have killed blue. But if I kill blue, like, it was close. If these guys both had ten less troops, I think I could chain kill all three of them. Yeah, yeah. Go ahead, take Africa. Just don't double break me, bro. That's okay. That's fair. Oh! oh. It's because I'm wearing this, right? Look at all these dudes. That's a screenshot. Anybody want to screenshot that? <laughs> Red's going to chill out in Japan with four cards. Comes back. Would you hit red for me? No, nah, he won't. He just wants North America. I wonder if green breaks all that or not. I can't even bring my three up. Oh. I'm going to go to Japan. Bring that up. I have a 56. I have a dude in artillery. Don't trade. Kill blue. Get the better set. Well, I'm, I'm going to try something, right? Like, now I need to... It was close. If I had 15 more troops... Because I was 10 troops above green, but it would have been 27 and 30 to kill the next two, giving me two more trades. So I would have lost 45 to 50, maybe got 20 back. I would have went into green with a, a disadvantage, but a bunch of his troops trapped. I just, I, the way I looked at it, it was bad. I also opened red to blue accidentally. Big mistake, right? Like now look what happens. Oops. Oops or doggers. Oops or doggers. Yeah, that makes sense. If he doesn't have a trade, I'm laughing. He does though. Yep. There it is. What's he doing? He's guarding South America. He doesn't know where to go with it. As far as Blue's concerned, I haven't betrayed him or done anything wrong to him. Like, I opened red to him on purpose, but I also wanted to go to Japan. Does he bring his 12 up? No. Ah, okay. So I'm going to take a card here. Leave my stack open to everything. I'm also going to grab a cavalry right now. There's a world in which this was like a 70-something, and I could kill green for five. But uh, we're not in that world, so we're just going to do this.
Ukraine, cool. I don't have a trade, but I have the Ukraine uh, thing, which is always a plus two when I get to use it. You wonder if Blue slams me for that. Yeah, he, he didn't, I guess he didn't recognize what I did. Like, I kind of subtly opened red up at the same time as looking like I'm running to Japan to hide my stack. Which I kind of also do want my stack out of the way. So I can come through. I don't want it. I didn't want to attack it to bring it in because it takes these territories and blocks my pathway of attacking. Yep. Give Green a thumbs up so he knows I can't, I'm okay. Nope. Now he gets a thumbs down. Green could have taken Africa and I would have been 100% fine with it. But now we're going to war. That was a mistake. Green's losing the game now off of that. Okay. What's red do? Does red crush blue? Green's going to feel the pain from that. I don't open the 34. I let him hit me with a 17 after I break all this. Is he ram blue or chill? He chills. Okay. Boom, 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 and come down and smack the 16, maybe? He doesn't want to hit him. Okay. Okay. That's going to cause problems, but I do have a plus... I have triple artillery with a plus two in Ukraine, so I can put a giant, a giant chunk on here. But it is, but I don't want to go to war with green. I want green to take Africa and be my friend. If he takes Africa and stops, we're friends. Thumbs up. Oh, stupid, man. That's a bad play. That was dumb. Thumbs up. I mean, if red tries to kill blue, that'd be great. No. Blue can't do shit to his 41 either. Red's just going to exist here. Okay. <laughs> oh. Not taking green down to, down to 11. I thought about it. I didn't want to trade yet. I want to retaliate. I figure he's going to trade now. Take Africa. Yes. Thumbs up. Thumbs down. He doesn't understand. He just doesn't get it. Like, so, the alternative I have is I could retake my bonus without breaking him and see if he's chill. And maybe he would be. Or maybe he uses those bonus troops to break me again. I don't want him to get too far ahead, though. I don't like him. Normally, you don't mind getting letting someone get too far ahead sometimes, but... 
I don't like him. So I don't want it. I don't want to. Red's still chilling. Blue's still chilling. That's the thing. Me and green fighting means these guys are just going to chill and build, right? Okay, I'm not I'm not going to I'm not going to do it this time. Save Scandy. I'm going to try this. I'm not hitting green. I also have a big trade on three. With a plus two on Scandy. Probably shouldn't have fortified that because I have to fortify that again anyways after the two goes on it. So here, I let him hold and does he use that to ram me or no? Maybe he rams blue instead. I literally just let him hold. This guy's a lunatic. The second I go through Australia, he quits the game. It's just, he's such a bad player. Like, if blue can knock this out, I would kill green right now. Red's not going to kill blue either. He's not going to do shit. Ah, oh, frustrating, man. Blue's not going to do anything. What do I do? What's my play here? Do I just give... I'll give green Europe. Do I give green Europe? I give green Europe and I go full stack in Alaska. I could also smack him. Nah. All right, guys. All right. You guys want to sit in the corner? I will sit in the corner. Yep, good luck. Good luck. Green can have everything. There you go. You want me to fight them one-on-one? -on -one? You, I'm, I'm not good. If I suicide with green, they win, right? That's why they don't want to help me. But there you go. Now Green can have everything. I'm completely out of his way. Go on. Take Europe. Take Asia. Take all of it. Let's see what happens. You can't fix stupid. I mean, that's fine. He's 103 trips. It's not the end. You have to be okay letting people get ahead sometimes. I don't want him to be ahead. But I, I'm just going to sit in the corner with this. If I can bring these three over, I'd be happy about it. I'm not going to get a chance to. He's just going to take everything. Look at this guy. He's like, I can own the whole board now. I bullied yellow out of Europe. Now everything's mine. There you go. You guys get what you want now. Take it. Good. There you go. Are you happy now? Are you happy now? <laughs> yeah. I would like to see blue trade and come off the 12, but he's not going to. He's going to take a card in here. I'm, I'm, I'm sticking to this. If they want to let them hold everything. What the fuck are you doing? You got to fortify.
Watch this. Mind blown. What's he get? 17 troops. He's going to take Asia. Green thinks he's the best player in the world. This is good. This is good. I shouldn't have blocked red. Yeah, maybe I should have went one further. I'm telling blue to attack green. He can't even now. This is the dumbest thing ever. Are you actually just going to let this happen, Blue? I guess Blue can't even do anything now. I might just kill Blue and take third. I, I I don't care. At this point, I don't care. I would rather kill an ally that's useless and let a guy that hits me over and over win than do the alternative and suicide with green. Okay. I get the kill on Blue. But now I can't I can't win the one on one with green now. And my 68's not pointed out. I'm happy to kill blue though. Oh, I can actually go out. Okay. Don't trade. Please don't trade. Open me. Fuck. Where are you going? Yeah, block my way from going through there. Okay, now I go through into green. I have to go into green. The only chance now is to go into green. I'm not killing blue or red for two cards. As dumb as this... This game is so dumb. Okay. Green have a trade? No. If they let me hold that, if they let me hold that, he might come right through the back and break, which is fine. 79 to my 47, but he's going to hit a bunch of them. Well, mostly me, I guess. 11, 10, 9, 8, 7, 6, 5 in. If he loses a couple troops, he doesn't get to Europe. Should have left like a 2 back here. Or 3. Fuck. Bad dice? No, great dice. Six, five, uh, he's in. He's in. Damn. The, we still have a chance to win, believe it or not. We just need these guys to also hit green. Huh. Like he takes South America. Keep going. Keep going. Oh, you gotta keep going, bro. Just the one. He's only gonna hit the one. He's gonna hit this one. This one. Oh, he's gonna hit a bunch of... Okay. What is this? Uh, frustration. This is frustration. That's what this is. We're really trying. I mean, if he doesn't kill us all, like, Green could have won the game by now. Because he's got more troops than all of us combined. So killing one person into a trade into another person, and like, that's just game at that point. 
At least I have a 31 that's active. He might even go try to kill Red now. Get terrible dice. Go down and up first. Wait, he can't kill Red. He's just breaking him. If he fights everybody and they everybody works against him, it's still doable. I'd have to go through a 4-5-1-1 to come up and kill Blue for four cards if he doesn't have a trade. I can't get into Red. Unless he comes down. He's leaving my 31 trapped. Interesting. That actually makes this pathway easier, though. Kill blue into red into punch green. It's not enough. I'm too far behind. I need them to trade and fight him, too. Oh. <clears throat> Bro, if, if I if I left like a three here, so he didn't get to break both of these, and I got that plus eight, that would have made a huge difference right now. He's actually just gonna run away from this. Th these guys. So there's ways to play the game at this stage where you're still fighting for first place, which I'm doing, or you're trying to hold on for dear life to get second or third instead of fourth, which is what it seems like these little babies are doing. They both have four cards. I could double kill them and take second right now. But I want first. I could double kill these guys and get second right now, guaranteed. This 36 is so useless, though. Can I double kill them and then ignore the 36? No, I can't, because that's still 50 troops of green I have to go through. Minus this 13. Well, I have a trade, though. This is, you know what, your help is not needed anymore. I'm done with you. Um. Attack green, up or no? Up. Okay. Hmm. Alright, I'm going to trust him. I, I could have killed red easy there, but if I do, I lose. <clears throat> so I send a message, I kill blue, and I tell red, attack, attack, yes or no? He says yes. If he works with me on green, we can make green third place, because he's not a good player. Well, he might be okay, He's, but he definitely not. He's he's an average player. But we could two-on-one him, even though he's got a, he's got enough to, to end us. But if red goes into him and I go into him, and we two-on-one, and then we both trade, our trades plus us hitting him two-for-one will bring him down to parity within like two to three turns. I just need red to help. Like, if red trades and goes at the bottom here, and then I can come... I don't have a trade, actually. So I might have to come through the bottom after... Let's see what he does. He can go through the top. I can go through the bottom. He can go through the bottom. I need him to hit green, though. I, I literally had my gun cocked at him, like, hit green or die? Please hit green. What, what can he actually do? One, 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 four, one. Please, just go into him. Hits the three great dice. Keep going, keep going. Yes, 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 yes. Just don't open the 36. Hits the eight. Oh, hitting the eight helps. But I, yes, the one, the four. Does he full? The one, the four. Keep going. He, don't open the eight. I'm going to go that way anyways. The one and the four and the... Okay, fine. I have to go with this as well. Oh my god, stop losing a troop every time you hit something. 
Lose nine on an eight. That's beautiful. Okay. Um, I'm actually just going to full on commit swinging. Green has no trade. So what's he get? Five. He only gets five. Okay, do I have a trade? I do. I have a big trade. Give Red a thumbs up. This could be a crazy comeback. I mean, if Red works with me. Oh, the red red could have done a little like if red instead of the three on one he could have kept his three because I have to come through here anyways. So instead of the three on one he should have went through and hit this four maybe, or sat with the eleven and the three like that was a he didn't need the three on one. Uh oh, Green finally made the correct play and brought his stack out. Come on. Come on, hit green with everything you got, bro. The two, the one, the four, the one. No, just give it to him. Thing is, do I not do I not trade? Because if I trade and leave a stack, green's gonna hit the stack. Oh my god, red's so nice right now. No, 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 stop, stop, please stop. Yeah, I fortify. Okay, green can't come through here or here. Green can't get me if I'm stacked here. Where's my plus? No plus. So I could actually trade. Where's my plus twos? I'm going to presume green doesn't have enough musto to kill red, right? 22. I mean... Knock him under 12. Position here. Ready to attack both ways. Let's see what he's got. <laughs> oh. He screwed up. He screwed up. He's only hitting me. He's only hitting me. He screwed up. Suck it. Yes. Trade on three. Please. Trade on three. Oh, green could have won there. Trade on three. Yes! That's my boy! Oh! I, I, I don't understand, but it's still going. We're still going. I'm not opening this 38. I would love if... Oh, please don't open it. No. Hit the 13. Not the 30. Or, or suicide the 38. Now he opens it! Fuck! That's actually really bad. Are you trying to kill me? Are you trying to get me dead? Green's only hitting... Like, green only focused on me there. He's left his 16 trapped, bro.
I need you to hit... Fuck, I should have three on one this, maybe? So I could easily get third here, and that's fine, right? I could have settled for second at any point. I could have killed red right after blue. But I'm playing for first. And I didn't take green ones out of here. Because if I take all of the green ones out, he's more likely to actually start swinging with the big stack. Instead of adding here and doing stuff. I want him to add here and do stuff. Now he's doing weird splits and shit, which is perfectly great. He's really keen on guarding Australia till the end of time. And now, red and I combined troops is more than green. Finally. It's taken a long time, but we're there. A little bit longer and we're there. Red's trade on three was great, but he didn't hit anything. He literally opened green to me and then passed. <laughs> 30, can't get past the seven. Stop trapping your stack, bro. Or, no, I can't take North America because the 30 is going to get me. He's literally trying to get the 30 in on me. Hmm, I think green breaks that, though. Where's my plus two? None. Thirty nine, thirty one, fifty five. He's going to add here and break red. Eight on three is a hundred percent. He gets in. Going to start hitting red ones here. Splits again. He does weird splits. He's splitting. Yeah, he's he's in his head he's hitting red now, because he could have I don't know. No, never mind. I jinxed it. Does he break red or does he forget about this over here? He's taking Asia. He's literally gonna try to take Asia. And I don't have a trade. Seven comes down, seventeen goes up. He's trying to bring the 17 to the 5, the 2. Bro, attack green. Fuck you, man. Could have just killed you. You're so useless. You're so useless, man. It is what it is. Lost seven on a five. Seven on a five. Knocked him one down. He gets five, six, seven. He gets seven troops. If green has a trade, my game's over. I did what I could. I think I'm getting third. Red's, Red's playing literal wimp mode trying to hang on for second place. I kind of should have suicided him, maybe. Maybe the 25 goes and kills him now. No, it doesn't. It knocks me out of here. Okay. Uh, yeah, maybe I should have taken NA. And, no, because I wouldn't have been able to hold this. Yeah, red taking a card and passing. Like, trade on three. He can't even do anything. He can't help me even if he wants to. He can't get out the 18. He's literally useless. Try to win the game, bro. Fuck. 18 on 18. Yes, please. He's going to skip. Well... That's a little bit of coolness. 
Brings that over. Yes, 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 yes. Thumbs up. Okay, we're still in it. Green already used his trade. Do I try a four on three? Do I try a four on three and I take a card here if it fails? I think I do. Succeed, please. Sixes. Cool. Cool. Um... Twenty-four, twenty-eight, fifty-seven. He gets eleven. Fuck. It's Fourteen on thirteen. Yep, that's game. Fuck, man. Red took too long being a chicken wuss, man. Cannot believe it. <clears throat> well, he didn't hit my thirteen actually. He's gonna if he go. No, he's only hitting yellow. Come on, bro. At least go break red in the back door. Red just hit you, and they stacked on you. Tell me you're going to at least break them. Dude, this is crazy. If I can get a big trade... If Red rams them hard, and I can get a big trade... The 17's still not open to my 13. Wait, he doesn't break them. Splits. 3-3? Three, 2-4. Three? He's trying to take and hold North America. He's literally only hitting me, too. Okay, come on, Red. Now is the time. Six on two. 20 comes out. Or just ramrod him with the 20 and I'll go break North America. Thank you. Just don't open the 17. Take Africa. One attack. One attack. Yes, okay. Of course. Makes perfect sense. Green doesn't have a trade, but he's going to get plus 2 and 8. He's going to get 10. Oh, this is terrible. What's he get? He gets 9. Got the card I needed. <clears throat> this game's turning into an absolute fiesta. Okay, he's breaking red now. Thank you. Now he's actually going to hit red. Maybe me that makes red hit him harder. Three on ones me. No? Fortifies? Back to guard. Dude. I mean, I have to hit more for territories, but then I'm losing and my stack's small enough you can roll it. <laughs> Come on, Red. Yeah, take Africa. The 17's traps. Can I actually take North America? Probably not. Where's he put the 20? Back here. Egypt or Western Europe? Um. Do I try to take NA right now? Give Red a thumbs up. If I can hold NA for one turn, maybe. No trade. Please, no trade. Starts with seven. He can't He can't break me. If Red lets me hold this. Thumbs up, thumbs up, baby. Oh, come on. Come on, Red. We could take Green down together. We're so close. He's down to 40, but he's going to have four cards. But Red's going to hold Africa, unless Green blitzes that. He blitzes it. But Red's still going to get 3. Go to 29. I'm going to get 8. Go to 32. Oh. Please, 
Please stop. Please stop there. You have to break Europe. You have to break Europe. You have to break Europe. I'm getting ready to dance, bro. This game's getting fucking great. What's up, Liberty Fires? Oh my god, that's the juicy boy taco. <clears throat> Green's got a trade. And he can't do as much to me as he can do to red. <laughs> Set dudes! Dudes! Did you? <laughs> More dudes pictures. Oh, oh my god, we're in this- we're in the game! I'm gonna trade dudes, I don't care. <laughs> I basically got a one point North America right now. This 18 sucks though, because I can't come out without opening the 18. Man, Liberty Fires, thank you. You just came in out of nowhere with a follow and dropped five gift subs. Thank you so much, bro. I don't know who you are or where you came from, but thank you. So I can't break Europe without opening this at 19, right? Because I'd have to come off my three. Yes. Green's got five cards too. So I actually can't take... I actually can't take a card right now. I get nine for 12. I can't take a card or it opens as 19. Oh my god. I can't open this. I can't open his 19. I have to skip. <clears throat> I don't think... I didn't need to trade. But... Bro, I know you're from Pete Streams, but haven't caught you live. Well, I'm happy to have you, man. Thank you. Smack the 19. I thought about it. But if I smack the 19, red's going to get to kill green for free. Right now, green wants to hit red. Oh, that might not even get into North America. That's why I didn't. Oh, it does get into North America. Shit. <clears throat> okay. Doesn't mean it's over, red. Thumbs up. Hit green. We're not done. We're not done. We're just getting warmed up, bro. What are these dice? Green has the dice of a, 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 a Greek god or something. Red has the trade. Yes. He's back in it. This 19's active. Oh, yeah. Is he not going to knock out the four and the ones? Go get him, green. 37 stack. I am in a great position all of a sudden. <clears throat> if red didn't have a trade there, I would have ended the game. I mean, yes, it would have been, oh my god, you killed your ally, but yes. I mean, that's kind of how it goes in the end. Red and I work on green, so we both have winning chances. Not both of us can win, though. Green chills? No, he, he's going to go break. My 37's scaring him, right? He's going to go hit red. It is scaring him. I don't think he hits the 15, though. I would love if he did. If he hits the 15, the game's over. If not. Where's he go? Center Europe. It's still, we're still good. We're still good. What's red do? If red feeds me green, I could win the game right now and give red second, but I don't think he's going to. I don't think he's that aware of his current position. That's a good roll.
No. Nope. He is still pissed at green, rightfully so. Oh, fuck! Green has 31. Can I kill him? Can I do this? Shit. Oh my god, this game, bros! <laughs> what are you doing? Oh man, this is funny. He's got three cards, I'm about to get a third card. I should win this 1v1, almost certainly. Oh my god. There we go. Yeah. Oh my god. Yeah, of course he has a big trade on three. It shouldn't matter. Genuinely might, might have been the best fixed game you've ever seen. Bro, when we pull these off, this this is going in this is going in the playlist. Greatest uh comebacks of all time again, because we've hit another one. Holy shit. Why didn't I take South America? Because it's I'm not rolling a three on one. I did five on one and lost a troop. If it, if if a, if I didn't lose a troop on this roll, I would have four on one it. But there's no point rolling a three on one. I already have the game. The only way I lose is getting terrible dice. So losing a three on one gives him more of an advantage. Also, well, terrible dice plus no cards and him having big trades on three. He had the big trade on three, but I also have a trade on three to come back with. I can come out right off Eastern United States. Now he'll know it's good game. Wow. Wow. Jesus, man. Props to Red for stepping up. Dude, big props to Red, man. This dude backed off and tried to play for second, and so did Blue. And I killed Blue, and I threatened Red into death, or fight Green with me, and he fought Green with me. And then, and then Red and I get first and second. So, like, big balls, that's all that matters. Sometimes you need big boy slapper energy. Oh my god. Oh my god, this game was sick. Holy crap. Screw that last game, this one's going on YouTube. Yeah, the last game's... Yeah, this is the game. This is the game. Wait, what the hell did this have roll? He rolled three troops into a five and killed it with only losing one. Red is beginner skill, but GM testicles? Holy shit, this game, man. Jesus, what are the ranks? It's not even gonna look as- it's not gonna look as impressive as the ranks, but holy- they're winning that? Come on. Okay, novice? Blue? Yeah, which- okay, made sense. He had no guts at all. Complete pansy. Black was a beginner. Okay. Yeah, black all of a sudden inted into pink, who's in Africa. Makes sense. 
Green and pink intermediate. Okay, so pink was good enough to get Africa, got out of Europe. He played rather smart. And then black inted into him, so he inted back. Suicided back, whatever. Uh, green, the super bully. You know, how many of you guys were telling me? Yo, don't let green push you around, man. Grab your nuts, man. Don't let him. He bullied me out of Europe. That Look at that. I let that guy bully me out of Europe. And then I bullied the weaker players into fighting him with me. To the point where I somehow came back 20 minutes later. I don't even have words for that. And then Red was an expert. And Red was Red played big balls, man. Big respect. Holy shit, that game. This is in the playlist. I have a playlist of the greatest comebacks of all time in Risk. Played by me. Uh, this is in that playlist. If you want to look at that playlist, click on the channel. And check that playlist out. There's more games like this in there. If you got this far in the video, please subscribe to the channel and I'll catch you guys tomorrow for more Risk unless you want more here or on that playlist. Whatever. I can't even speak right now. See you guys later.